Kaboom. Got him. That is Jim Seven in the books. The first thing that we have to do, or one of the first things, uh, is we get some new encounters. Uh, in Icarus City, which is where we are, in Route 8, we get a chance at Shell Armor Shelmet, um, which are both quite good. Uh, we want, I think they're the same Pokemon for each of these two routes. Like, I don't think there's an alternative that I can get. I think it's Shelmet or Bust. I'm going to say Shelmet or Bust. Um, so all we're going to do is we're going to try and catch the first one, but we need to do a check to see if it has hydration or shell armor, because shell armor is amazing. Um, the way we have to do that, though, is, uh, we have to make it rain, um, and I don't think we have anyone with rain dance, and I don't think we have that item, and I don't think I want to go buy that item, um, <laughs> just to do that. So hopefully it's raining. It's snowing. So I don't think that counts. Yeah, so we need to make it rain, which is the problem. So we're going to the house to the right of the Pokemon Center. Talk to this lady. This lady. The reminder girl. Yes. So, okay. Strategy for catching a Shelmet is we're going to rain dance to trigger the rain. We're gonna toxic it. If it heals its ability, then it has shell arm. Or if it doesn't heal its ability, it has shell arm. If it heals its ability, we run and uh, it's got the wrong one. And then we just try for a second one. I hope you can catch these in the winter. Because I notice it doesn't say January, May, September. I'm gonna have to change my cl game clock. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm gonna think I'm gonna have to change my game clock. <laughs> well, this should be fun. Do I need to enter and leave a building? Enter a building? Leave a building. Yep, of course. You know, I'm now wondering if I didn't have to teach it rain dance because it's raining. This is so stupid. Okay. <laughs> well, you know, you live and you learn, I suppose. Also, did not know I could set the date, the clock like that, so that's cool. Shelmet! Okay, so we found the Shelmet. We need to test if it's hydration or shell armor. The way we do that is it, if it's hydration, it has in the rain, it will get rid of its status conditions. So, we're just going to Toxic it, assuming that it doesn't have any moves that are like super good. It has Protect, Yawn, Mega Drain, and Struggle Bug. Mega Drain is spooky, but I'm super specially defensive, and this is not a Grass type, so we're going to Toxic it. We're going to Toxic it again. <laughs> and if it has Hydration, it should cure itself of poisoning. Okay, I'm gonna give it one turn just to make sure that it's not a one turn thing. Then we're gonna try and catch it. Okay, this should do more damage, but it's not gonna do that much. And of course it was a crit. Okay. It is not healing itself, so it has shell armor. So now we're gonna try and catch this guy. Bag. Pokeball. Netball. Let's get it. Shelmet caught, baby. Okay. What food does Shelmet remind you of? My, it's a snail Pokemon. We've already called something else S, S Cargo this run, so we're not going to name it that. Hot dog? You know what? I'll take hot dog. That's fine. I'm good with it. It's pink. It's got a little pink, little kissy lips. <laughs> so we're gonna go, I'm just gonna go with hot dog, sure. <laughs> okay, let's see the Shelmet. A 
a that's a shell armor shell mitt, boys. It's quiet. It's quiet hot dog. Oops. Summary. What does quiet mean? Minus speed plus special attack. I think that's probably fine. I mean, oh my gosh, that's super good. Its speed is already garbage. And then it's attack and special attack are both 40. So either one of those to get up to was really good. And it's defense, it's very defensive and special defense is all right. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move it to the box. Cause this is gonna be helpful for us in the Dragon Spiral Tower, which is where we are going to attempt to take the Iron Throne today. Okay, encounter time. Let's get it. 100%. Let's hope for level 30, 31. That'd be cool. 32. <laughs> well, you can't win them all. That's fine. We have a sub level 31. So we're okay. Get in the ball, buddy. One, two, three. Got him. Think of a nickname, everyone, for a galette. The theme is food that the Pokemon remind you of. <gasps> Rock cakes. That's a good one. I think we'll do that. <sighs> okay. Moment of truth. Does it have a terrible ability? Iron Fist. Oh, whoo. Okay. So just as an aside, so everyone's aware why this was almost super, super spooky. This thing can get two abilities. It can either get Iron Fist, which increases the power of punching moves by 20%, which is fine, or it can get Klutz, which means it can't receive any of the effect of held items other than items that basically do nothing during battle, <laughs> which is terrible because we're doing a little lock and basically that is like all we have going for us is, uh, <laughs> is, those, uh, is those held items. Um, it's got super good typing. Ground and Ghost is very nice. Um, let's check. Ooh, it's quiet again. So it's minus speed plus special attack, which not a special attacker by any means, <laughs> but it's also not fast. So it is what it is. Bump. Bump. All right, we got easy peasy. Okay, we're just gonna toxic stall this because this can't hit us. All it has is, um, all it has is, yeah, I'm not saying that one out, out loud there, Andrew. Um, all it has is, <laughs> um, normal moves and I'm a ghost type. So we're just gonna watch as it just, dies to poison. Last one. And that is what we call a toxic stall. Get her done. Easy peasy. Don't take this as strong or the wrong. How could I take this the wrong? How could I take that the wrong way? <laughs> I will. I would be surprised if there was a wrong way to take it. But thanks. If you find this video attractive, almost as much as me, maybe <laughs> like the video and subscribe to the channel. Um, cringe. Okay, uh, we just signal beam. It's probably gonna fake out. Oh, wow. Or not. That's fine. Just one hit kill it. That's what I'll take it. Oh. Oh, indeed. Oh, it has shed skin. I'm not going to be... I'm not going to be using Thunder Wave. It did go down for a sec. Oh, well, that's super weird. I didn't have any stats on my end indicating that that was happening. <laughs> Which is super fun. Uh, maybe just on YouTube's end. But we'll see. Okay. 
So, these are the moves that we have. I would normally Thunder Wave, but this thing has Shed Skin, and so we're not going to use that. We're just going to Electro Web to slow it down, just in case we have to switch to something else. Oh, this is going to do some damage. Or not. <laughs> uh, I think I'm just going to Signal Beam probably kills, actually. Does it kill? Nope. Close. <laughs> yes, spam headphones emojis in the chat. Um, <laughs> yeah, they're AirPods Max. I definitely would not recommend them. Uh, they are overkill and they are usually over expensive. I think they're normally like $450, which is insane. Never pay that much. Uh, I think I got these on like a crazy sale for like 350 And so like, they're probably worth it at that price. But also, they have a lightning port. I feel like they're about to redo them. There are features in the new AirPods too that are like better. Um, yeah, they're, they're very nice headphones. Don't get me wrong, but they are... Um, overkill for like 90% of people and honestly probably me as well the only reason I got them is because my other headphones broke and I needed new ones and I was either spend 400 or 300 on bows or 350 on these so I was like might as well get these airpods because I like my airpods pros so much so that was the thought process thanks for coming to my TED talk on headphones brought to you by my personal time <laughs> Wow, you rich. Big ballin' over here. <laughs> it's that no YouTube money, that's what it is. <laughs> it's that not making YouTube money. Torment. Torment fake out hone claws and assurance. Okay, so I think we just kill. Okay, yeah, we just kill. <laughs> Got one. I have as many advertise. <laughs> hey, <laughs> you know what? At some point, that's true, and I will. I can. I'll put that as as like part of the description. Oh damn, that was a big crit. I need a switch. Um, but I'm gonna kill, so it's probably fine. Uh, <laughs> that could be like a tag. Is like I have the same adver number of advertisers as Twitter, but. Ooh, sucker punch. Okay, so we can always reteach Thunder Wave. I think we probably get rid of Thunder Wave. Uh, because we have that as a TM. So I'm for sure going to do this. Sucker Punch is a priority move that basically, if the opponent use, is going to use a damaging move, I can sneak in a Sucker Punch and uh, it will do damage before. Okay, we got Watch Hog, Crocorock, and Scraggy Doo. What is dark not very effective against? Fighting and dark and fairy. Okay, perfect. I have the perfect switch in for this. Adios, Andrew. Hope you have a good weekend. Okay, so we're going to toxic. Oh, switched. Switching strats. Here we go. Gets the Intimidate down, but it's not going to matter, really. <laughs> so we're going to protect to see what move it uses. Embargo, okay. So, uh, here's what we do. This is pretty pretty straightforward. Uh, we use Protect, it's probably going to use either a Dark move, which is going to do nothing to Chick-fil-A, because it's double not very effective. Or it uses Dig, and in which case, then we just switch to our Shelmet, which should be able to take that pretty good. We use a Swagger, which is annoying. But I think we just switch again here. It's not going to use a Dark move. It's probably going to use a Ground move. 
So it's got Embargo, Swagger, Crunch, and Dig. Crunch does n m four minus? Yeah, not good against Fighting and not good against Dark. So it's going to use Dig, and so we're just going to switch to Hot Dog. Plus, that gets rid of our confusion, so. Oh, wow, it actually crunched. That's fine. I think we can just protect stall, but we might just Giga Drain. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to protect. <laughs> stall it out. Oh, of course it digs. <laughs> Does it die? No. Double protect. Double protect! Let's go! <laughs> Woo! Got him! <laughs> That's a short. Okay, now we got the Watch Hog, which remember, is completely walled by our Calamari. So we just switch back into this. Get wrecked. <laughs> Bite. Toxic again. I'd imagine it probably switches, yep. And we basically go through the same steps. So it's got Payback, which can hit us. Brick Break and Chip Away can't do anything, and neither can High Jump High jump Kick. So it's just got Payback. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to just Protect, just to make sure that it uses that. And then we switch into Chick-fil-A, because can only use Payback. I think we just protect because we should outspeed normally, I think. It'll take more poison damage, and then we should almost certainly be able to brick break kill it from here. Super effective. Got him. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Okay. I think I am going to... I think I'm just... This is where, like, we get to the point in the game where, like, we just need to play it as safe as humanly possible, so I'm just going to switch back into the thing that it can't touch. <laughs> and we are just going to stall it out. It wants to not die so bad, guys. <laughs> this watch hog wants to not die, and it is going to get poisoned to death. I respect the hustle. But you ain't taking us on today, buddy. Good job. Pat, 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 pat on the head. <laughs> Uh-oh. Gauntlet time. Oh, sh <laughs> Here we go. Is it four? It is four. Okay. I think we got four back to back, so we got a mini gauntlet here. Um, we always wreck shop on this here watch hog, but we'll toxic it. It's gonna withdraw it. We already basically went through the strat once, but we're gonna do it again. Crunch or Swagger. Now we switch into Chick fil A. Chick fil A. Hopefully it doesn't Swagger. That's fine. Embargo is fine. Crunch is a bad candy. Oh my god, I totally forgot what Crunch was. Yes! It is, it is, uh, underwhelming candy. <laughs> Who would have thought that puffed rice is unexciting, <laughs> other than everyone? 
Obviously. I don't know why you would crunch this, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Makes no sense. It's like 4x not effective. Hey, is Hyper Fang the one that does like way too much damage? <coughs> yeah, it's 80. And might make me flinch. Alright, now we switch into our walls it. This is the only reason that maybe having Gotlet would have been good here, is that I would be able to just pivot between ghost types instead of wasting moves. But maybe what I can do is... Because it knows it can't use a move against me. Maybe I just protect. Pokemon, switch to Hot Dog. We get a Protect in here, and then we'll switch to the other guy. Protect, and then we'll just switch between between guys that can protect. Wants to do damage to me so bad, y'all. <laughs> it is not going to be able to. <laughs> I guess I'll recover once. That's the one where I have PP to spare. <coughs> Power points. Power points. Next up. Bum ba dum ba dum ba dum bum. Bum bum bum. Okay. All right. So I think we're just gonna start by switching immediately because it's probably gonna want to use Crunch. Switch into Chick Filla. Okay. Annoying. Fighting and dark, right? So we switch now. I think we're gonna switch into turtle soup so we can just tank a crunch. If it uses dig, we just switch into uh, shellman. Okay, that did not do a lot of damage. I think we get an aqua jet and then we try and switch. What is my favorite candy? Honestly, I don't know if I have a fit. Wow, we just kill. Holy cow. I don't know if I have a favorite. Honestly, Sour Patch Kids are pretty baller. I feel like it's that. Like whenever I'm on like a road trip, if I ever like need a little bit like a like candy, I feel like I just always go for Sour Patch Kids. It's probably Sour Patch Kids. That's what I'd say. Extremely underrated. So we can't poison this. We can Ominous Wind. It's got Takedown, which you can't use, and Sludge Bomb, which I'm... Poison Ground is not very effective against Ghost. Okay, so... Stockpile, Swallow. Yeah, so I think we just Ominous Wind and Recover. Sour Patch Watermelons are a disgrace. <laughs> I just feel like they're so bad. Stockpile level 2? Well, I'm hoping that we can get an Omni Boost. That'd be super cool, huh? Take a, okay, this thing does not have... I don't know what this thing is thinking, man. Wow, that did nothing. Oh, it poisoned me. Yeah. 
annoying. Ha! Huh, nice. Now it can't hit me. <laughs> oh, and then we get the Omni Boost as we kill it. Of course. <laughs> Why would it be another way? Okay. This thing has Torment, Fake Out, Home Claws, and Assurance. Um, so we switch to Chick Filla. Owie. Not damage being done today, Brick Break. Okay, while this goes, I need to go turn on my background lights. Got a couple level 40s. They're gonna try to evolve. As a reminder, we cannot evolve because Little Ox. Last one. We got a Watch Hog. We'll actually be able to use Recover on this one. Super Fang. After you psych up and Hyper Fang. Walled by the Ghost Fish. It wrecked. Wait, did I not poison it? Did I miss? Wow, I'm stupid. Ain't be ain't be paying attention. Did I actually miss? What am I crazy? Did it have a berry on it? Wow, whoops. <laughs> Definitely just like wasted a recover and the protect. Fully healed, takes poison damage first, dies. I don't know if I actually end up, or no, I do. Before the battle ends, of course. Why not? I like how, because I defeat them in battle, they're just like, okay, you can go thwart our plans. <laughs> it's story time. Ooh, I've never seen this part before, by the way. I'm going to pay attention, and then I'll respond to chats in a second. Zekrom? I liked the growl. What do you think, X-Man? How do you like the powerful form of the Pokemon who appears before and fights beside the hero that will lead the way to the new world? A new world, but whatever. Now Zekrom and I will head to the Pokemon League and defeat the champion. This will be the last of the Pokemon battles that hurt Pokemon, so a world for Pokemon alone, it's finally going to be a reality. Whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> You want to stop me, you must become a hero as well. That's right, when Zekrom's counterpart, Reshiram, recognizes you, we will finally be even, and then you can try to stop us. Well, what will you do? My prediction is the future that I see is true. You will meet Reshiram, the Pokemon with you. Wow, the Pokemon with you believe in you so strongly. Will you be the one who interferes with my formula for changing the world? If you want to protect the bonds between Pokemon and people, you must search for Reshiram. I'm sure it is waiting for you in the form of the Lightstone. Okay, what are we doing? Oh, it's still happening. Zoop! 